In this illustration, we intend uh, to simulate the hysteresis analysis of beam column connection with vertical stiffener in the Abacus software. As you observe in this picture, the model is composed of beam, column, shear plate, and vertical stiffener. In this question, continuity plate has not been utilized and a vertical stiffener has been used instead. In this picture, the place where the vertical stiffener is can be clearly observed. In this question, a cyclic loading is applied to the end of the beam and following that, its hysteresis diagram is drawn. In this picture, the hysteresis diagram obtained from the Abacus software has been compared with the experimental results. In this picture, the deformation of the model undergoing a cyclic loading is observed. Actually, we intend to simulate this article in the Abacus software. The article is entitled an alternative detail for continuity plates in steel beam to box column moment connections. In this picture, the model having been simulated in Abacus software can be observed. In this picture, the hysteresis diagram having been drawn is observed. I will click on create part again. I intend to create geometric shape of the column. Continue. I will draw a square. The length and width of the square is 300 millimeters. Done. The length of the column is equal to 2600 millimeters. Yield stress is equal to 368.8 megapascal. Ultimate stress is equal to 521.1 megapascal.
In the next step, we intend to draw the hysteresis diagram of the model. Actually, we intend to draw this diagram. I will click on Create XY Data, select ODB History Output, and Continue. Here, I will select all reaction forces, click on Save As, then I will sum all reaction forces up together. In the next step, I will click on Create XY Data, then on Operate on XY Data and continue. Here, I will select Combine. First, select U3 and then Total Force and click on Save As. Here, you observe the hysteresis diagram having been drawn in the Abacus software. The first column is displacement, the unit of which is millimeter. The second column is force, the unit of which is newton. The diagram having been drawn in pink color is the one obtained from the Abacus software. As you observe, the results gained from the Abacus software are very close to those mentioned in the article, indicating that this article has been simulated correctly and properly in the Abacus software.